The Napier Heights neighborhood of Macon lost easy access to healthy food when a nearby Kroger closed in 2018. Resident Andrea Cook says that is a problem. If you don't have good food, then your health is impaired. So now Cook is trying to help. She's starting a neighborhood food co-op in Napier Heights. A food co-op is a grocery store owned by its customers. In this case, the people in Napier Heights. We really want this to be something that's driven, run, and owned by the people who it will be serving. Anyone in Macon can become a member. They just have to pay a small fee or volunteer at the co-op. But only members from Napier Heights will have voting power. That's because the co-op is about community ownership. When people have community buy-in, then they, they take care of it more. Especially when, if you help to create something, then you want to help it to sustain. But first, the co-op needs startup money. Cook says the co-op is going to be open air when they start off. Right now, they have the funding to purchase a vacant lot. But they are still working on raising $15,000 to get the market open. Eventually, Cook wants the co-op to be able to accept SNAP and EBT benefits. This is because keeping the food affordable is key, because otherwise... Well, we're just creating another barrier. If people can't afford the food, then it, it doesn't help the community. But Cook hopes that they can open up shop by this fall. It's all, Funding is always an issue, but we're going to make this happen no matter what, because our community means this much to us. For GPB News, I'm Lars Lonroth in Macon.